thank you, thank you. Um, good evening, everybody. Uh, tonight is all about um, the great talent that Buff has showcased over the last 12 months and will continue to showcase in the year ahead. The winner of tonight's award uh, provides recognition of that talent and the high regard that he has held in by their fellow peers, film critics and audiences alike. Jesse, over to you. Um, I just want to say, you know, making a film is such a difficult thing. Um, you know, even making a bad film is a challenge. So I, I just think before I announce the nominees, uh, it'd be great to give all of them a round of applause. For this year's uh, uh, nominees, um, the best, the best for best feature film, they are *The Intent*, co-directed by Femi Oyeni Run and Calvador Peterson. <laughs> A United Kingdom by Ama Asante. <laughs> Residential by the director Dimas Pascal. and To Dream by Nicole Illiberali. And now let's take a look at the work of these talented directors. One way or another, with or without you, innit? You're either in or you're not. Father will hate him on sight. He's cleverer than him and he's black. She might change her mind. I've met the man I want to spend my life with. Are you insane? White, British, and she's a salesman's daughter. My grandfather was a king. I am his heir. I have a responsibility to return home to my people. I will never achieve anything worthwhile if I leave my heart here. I am the government's representative in Southern Africa. The policy of apartheid. Black. You know this word. If you choose to marry the leader of an African nation, you will be responsible for the downfall of the British Empire in Africa. Have you no shame? crazy dreams. I dreamt that we had it all. We were happy. The war of the wild is what tore us apart. But for me, those moments, those memories and dreams are, are all the same. They were purity at its best. We sang a song of a younger world. A younger pack. Wild, yet sinless. Untainted. Flawless. Free. What a powerful stuff there. Powerful stuff. Everyone's a winner, but as they say, um, there can only be one. And the winner of the uh, Buff Film of uh, the Year is The Intent, directed by <laughs> Femi Oyunmiran.
thank you. Um, thank God. Um, thanks to everyone that was part of the intent. It was a difficult project in that we, you know, we did everything. This is the team behind the intent. We put it out, we released it, we did everything ourselves. And we, we started that journey with a conversation that Nikki and I had um, after having some disappointment within the industry. So, you know, the intent is just a message to everyone. If you have an idea, do it, create it. I mean, we made that film. Like, we marketed it, distributors turned us down. Like, you know, it's now on Netflix, we've made money from it. Like, you know, and so, and so. Thank you, thank you all, thank you, Buff. And um, also, you know, thank you to everyone that, you know, sort of takes part in this industry. And also, to, mainly I'll, I'll speak specifically to people that are black in this industry. It's so hard, it's hard. Like, you know, I'm, we're up against it. And it's also for the people that are able to do it to a high level, it's a privilege. We have a privilege and we have a responsibility to, to represent people that are not necessarily represented by the mainstream media. So let's, let's, handle that privilege with care. So um, thank you, I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you gents, and well done once again. The best feature film. Yeah, it's, it's, it's amazing. How do you feel? No, it's brilliant, it's brilliant to be recognised by Buff. Obviously Buff have supported us over the years. They, they showed my first short film like years ago. I didn't, I'd, like Manuel likes to remind me of that every so often. That was yeah. the best bit. What it was, was called Fresh Off the Boat. No one wants to watch that. It's not good. <laughs> watch the intent. It's on Netflix. And so, um, <laughs> and so, um, yeah. So it's it's nice to 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 get recognition for you know what, what we've done and like you know it's just it's brilliant. And how what does Buff feel like? What does it mean to you? Uh, well, I suppose like you know it's really good like to see the growth of Buff. For me, like you know, I was talking, I was on the radio yesterday and I was talking about Buff, and it's like. You know, it's nice to see the growth and like to see the idea like every year just get better and better this year. It's like the BT Tower, who knows like where it's going to be next year, like you know, like the Shard or something. Like, yeah. <laughs> and so it's like, you know, no, but it's like, it's brilliant. It's brilliant just to see like, you know, as we grow, Buff grows and like, you know, hopefully like as, as the, the industry and opportunities that exist for black entertainers within this country expands, um, Buff and organisations such as Buff, but because Buff is beyond the award, right? <laughs> Organisations, organisations such as Buff having enough finances to continue to grow their business and also, like you know, really support the industry and nurture.